right. Testing, testing. One, two, three. One, two, three. That's the sink. Is one. Oh no. <laughs> Let me try that again. One, two, three. One, two, three. Well, I suck at that. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Okay. So this is me making a vague effort at a. Oh my god, those character models are gorgeous. I'm attempting to record some uh, Pokemon Sword footage. Um, however, unfortunately, I still do not have a capture card, so this quality is going to be quite shit. This is literally just a webcam pointed at the TV, and there's not been a lot uh, done with the quality either, so unfortunately, this is just. it is what it is for the moment. Do I really want to be that default? I think the last time I went with Blondie. Uh, It'll be quicker to customize the first one into me, unfortunately, because I'm a very generic looking white boy. So, unfortunately... <laughs> Alright, I'm, I'm gonna go with an old classic. This was an old joke. Back in the days of playing Fable. Because uh, everyone would call you Hero. No matter what you chose your name, they'd be like, Hero, we need your help! So I deliberately wrote the name as Hero. So, seem like, yeah, you know, I'm not clever. <laughs> Registration complete. Alright. I don't know anything about this game other than the spoilers that I caught, so... Oh. I did pick the right language, didn't I? I hope I picked the right language. God. If I didn't, I'm about to find out. Welcome, one and all. Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. This guy looks dead inside. <laughs> Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Is it Galar or Galar? I'd say it's Galar, probably. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with which we share our city lives. So you know, our society is able to thrive because we have our slaves! No. Oh, I've not seen that one! <laughs> it's like a Fampy knockoff. It's like Fampy got mashed into Camerot. <laughs> the sea, the sky, and even with us in our towns. I'm not going to read all of this, but <laughs> I'm sure he's very hammy. <laughs> yes, the point of these games. Trainers. <laughs> I'm surprised there isn't a, a large group like Black and White had, I think, where uh, they had people who just didn't like trainers. <laughs> Rose. So he's not the professor? Because that's not... Is that a tree? I don't know. Uh... Champion Leon. Oh wow, we actually get to see the champion immediately. Some games you don't see the champion at all until the last minute. Ah, here we go. Very fancy coat. Oh yeah, we've seen that. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Is it Duraldon? I like the character models, they're very Raihan, oh wow. Very crisp. Uh, you're standing way too close for that. <laughs> He's a silly <laughs> one. Well, that's unreasonably large. <laughs> Pokemon Sword. And it's going to turn out that that stadium is not big enough for two Dynamax, so there go the stands. <laughs> Wooloo! So I've seen some spoilers here or there, but um, I've avoided any gameplay whatsoever. That is a gorgeous house. I had to get off Facebook really quickly as well, because I saw people were already posting up screenshots. Like, I saw this, this living room. That's a huge jump from the last games. I mean, it's like, it's not insane graphics, but it really just doesn't matter. <laughs> hello, hello! <laughs> this is hot, then. Alright. Your Flash new phone? I assume that Flash is this uh, region's version of... Oh, I'm trying to remember what it was. I swear there was a word like this in Sun and Moon. And how kept using it. I can't remember what it was now, but it was... It was oh boy. Alright. 
cut to your mom with your hands full. Eh, well, you know. <laughs> what? Are you- hang on. Are you telling me that pose is supposed to look like a Charizard? Because I don't think a Charizard can make that pose with its stubby little arms. <laughs> Oh my god, I see we're going with the Spider-Man theme of <laughs> parental figures. They're just getting younger and hotter. <laughs> so, well, I didn't say that. <laughs> it's the glasses. <laughs> Is this the big, big day? Oh well, of course, it's always the big day. Actually, that's not true. I think there was one where you weren't supposed to be a trainer, but you... Yeah, well, I'm pretty sure in Ruby and Sapphire you just stole... <laughs> well, not stole, but like, you just nabbed one from the professor by accident. Alright. Never mind watching the match now. Got a recording at home anyway. Oh my god, all these modern references were like, okay, we'll start acknowledging that technology exists. Because <laughs> like, they had little hints of it here or there in the previous games, but they went, I don't know, all the background stuff doesn't need any regular technology. It looks like they're going the opposite direction now, finally. <laughs> Should be here any minute. Um, Lee always brings presents when you visit. Who's Lee? <laughs> oh my god, you have to bring an entire bag for this guy's presence? <laughs> Imagine coming to visit a friend with a bag just expectantly, like, huh? Huh? <laughs> Bitch, I'm comfy. Is he playing a Switch? Oh. Oh, wait, really? Uh, I thought it was still a cutscene. Oh my god, well, the movement is giant. Oh my god. Rolling around at the. Thank you. <laughs> really? <laughs> That would still be in the game. And they added the bloody pose as well, that's really funny. I think it was a sound effect too. Can I sit down again? Nope. Once I'm up, I can't get back down, but that's really funny if I do that again. Hang on. <laughs> in another direction this time, that's funny. <laughs> Comedy dramas, right. Oh my goodness. Oh, we have a pet Munchlax! <laughs> Wait, is there leftovers item there? Can I take it? No. <laughs> that we busted. Leftovers before I even have a starter. Oh my god, the radiators. There's the munchlax. Wake up. Oh, he actually did. Gers. Gers. Om gom. <laughs> Greedy little bastard. Uh. Oh, I like the shirt color. It's pretty vibrant. <laughs> the broom. Oh, this is just, if this feels like a totally different game, this doesn't feel like Pokemon at all, and like in a good way. Oh, well there's that bag. It's your dad's old bag. Ah, that won't do. I'm gonna have to get a new bag, aren't I? <laughs> that, that looks like it's ca for carrying like a musical instrument. Oh, the sock hat. <laughs> Was I wearing that minute ago and I'm just stupid? Oh. Right, so menus X, of course. Ba -ba -ba. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, cool. Yep, I'm gonna actually X and just save now, just before I forget. Oh my god. These screens are really good looking. I love how crisp the colors are. <laughs> well, she bought the whole TV for so you could use her game console? What a privileged only child. <laughs> Mind you, at least it's not bad as some of the games where you have a bedroom and your mother doesn't. <laughs> just sleeps in the kitchen. <laughs> it's the bed you went to buy as a family. Wait, does she have a bedroom? It puts you to sleep instantly. That's not suspicious. That is a rad EV poster. Oh, the obligatory reference. Yep, yeah, the latest video game console is sitting by the telly. That's not that close to the telly. God, what is that poster? Nope, I can only click on the desk. <laughs> you can even keep using when you become an adult, you know, as opposed to those child desks. Is there something in there? Can I actually look in the order? Nope, can't change my style or anything yet. Wait, really? Hang on. Okay, there is a door there, so maybe my mom does have her own bedroom. <laughs> but um, so far it's looking like maybe she doesn't. Or we just sleep in the same bed. Sweet home Alabama. <laughs> I'm sure he is. Alright, no going to the forest for the two of you. We're absolutely going in the forest. 
<laughs> State of the art microwave oven that Mum insisted on buying. You know, making those frivolous purchases as, as opposed to a, an entire TV just for my game console. That's a smart fridge. It's your family? It's interesting it phrased it that way. Is your dad actually a thing in this game? Because usually there's just a mom. I only remember one gen where they even mention your dad, and that's because he's a gym leader. Alright, where's the front door? Here we go. Ooh. Ah, that's not enough time to memorize that map. <laughs> Aww. I like all the plant life. It's really pretty. This looks like something from the Shire. That's what it looks like. Oh, actually, that might be the point. Because <laughs> it's meant to be UK theme. Ooh, but you. I mean, like, is that like a pet, or does it just live here out here because it's a garden? Can I... Nope. I can't interact with the post, post box? No. Can't get around the side of the house. Nope. Nope. Just locked into this path. That's fine. You have to talk to him. Mm. <laughs> that old bag looks like it could pull you over. Well, what do you mean by that? At least we know that it should hold anything Lee might bring, even if it's as big as a Snorlax. I think it is... I assume he means bowl you over, or pull you over, I guess. Just like... Yeah, it's, the phrasing seems weird to me. I think he's right, but yeah. Woo-loo. Oh, well, you're bright. You're gonna succeed this time, right? What's it doing there? Uh, headbutting that fence. Oh, it's... Looks like it's using, like, rollout, but I don't think there's enough weight to it to do any real damage. Oh, it's... <laughs> that's just tackle? Okay. <laughs> no going past that fence. No, it's definitely going to listen to you. Everyone knows there are scary Pokemon living in the slumbering wild. Well, we're definitely going there. <laughs> Me? <laughs> yep. Now that that's taken care of, he's still doing it. You didn't... <laughs> you didn't accomplish anything. <laughs> uh, wait, can I actually race him in real time? I feel like most of the time in Pokemon games when your rivals or friends move, you were locked in place and they <laughs> sawed off. <laughs> you have no way of catching them. Um, so to actually be able to foot race them is kind of funny. I'm sure it's just to teach you the, the run mechanic, which is probably B. Uh, but I can make it your my house first. What with you lugging about that big old bag? Yeah, I'm sure I'm used to it. Oh, nope. Uh, apparently I cannot move while he is moving. So that seems fair. There we go. So he's obviously going to beat me because I am frozen in place like he's using Zawerdo. <laughs> Hello. The power of science is amazing, he says in this countryside farm with a windmill. <laughs> ah, okay. Wait, what? You can battle and trade Pokemon with other people just by walking around. By walking around or while walking around? Well, <laughs> I don't think walking counts as trading. <laughs> I'm sure it's because you, um... I hope they maintain this mechanic. They put the Pokemon box in, like, your bag in, um... Uh, let's go. Maybe that would be too convenient for this. I did see someone uh, saying that there might be an issue with that because it used to be if you put something in the box, it was fully healed. So if you take it, there. so if you would never need potions or revives or anything, you just open your box, put something in, take it back out, fully healed. So I assume that's not kind of be how it works. But yeah, um, I don't know if it keep, just keeps track of their um, health this time, or if they didn't, uh, if they're not doing it this time. I can't remember. if which way it works to in Eevee. Yeah, let's go Eevee either. I'd have to go back and check. All right, let's stop getting sidetracked. Hop's house. Oh, he's got a little arena. That's so cute. <laughs> um, a garage, I guess. Hmm. The barbecue. <laughs> it's a well-used barbecue. This isn't based on the UK. We don't have sun. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't say we anymore. Don't live there now. <laughs> oh. Knock, knock. It's me. Coming in, even though your son isn't home. Your home is my home now. Oh, he is here. I thought he was going to be further down the road. Oh, no, he did say race to here. I'm stupid. <laughs> there, you are. there you are at last. Uh, where's Lee? Have you got him crammed in a cupboard? What? <laughs> is this what the Japanese think of the English? I mean, they're not that wrong, but... <laughs> He's not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hoppy must learn some patience. He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. Wedgehurst? That sounds more German than British. Well, that's where I'm going. You know Lee is hopeless with directions. 
Well, he's gonna be in the forest, surely. But you know, you know that place uh, that we said that uh, we shouldn't go. Yeah, he's gonna be there. <laughs> oh, will you? Yes, that is probably for the best. Oh, oh, it's his big brother, undefeated champion. Oh wait, I thought Leon was the undefeated champion. So who's this Lee guy? Unless Lee is like short for Leon. Hmm. Well, I assume that these things are going to be saying the same thing. Wait, what about her microwave oven? Mm, let me see it to you. Let me see your woman. Your, your woman? <laughs> let me see your oven. Microwave? No, I won't let me. Nah. It won't let me judge her for her purchase. <laughs> uh, umbrellas. A door that I can't open. I, like, listen to the sound of me just hitting the door. <laughs> oh. Uh, Purloin? I think it was. I can't remember now. Oh god. Oh! Maybe it is Leon then, because look at this guy. Oh, it is him! Look at the pictures! Oh, that's really cool! So that uh, that's interesting. I, I don't I don't think they've done that before. They have the champion related to someone right away. That's interesting. And then he'll turn out to be a villain. <laughs> I'm sure he'll be kind of the C Stephen Stone of this game. Oh, what is it? Books about the champion. I see plates. <laughs> it's one of the TVs that uh, Hop always watches the champion's matches on and nothing else. <laughs> Alright, let's get a move on. Oh, actually, uh, I'll take a quick peek upstairs. If I can. Yep. I'm sure there's probably just more side strike. Oh, hello. Oh, so, okay, so poor old Leon doesn't have time to manage his massive collection of hats. Is this Leon's room or Hop's room? Hang on. Okay, this is... This has got to be Leon, right? Right? Sheets are very wrinkled. No, then this is probably uh, Hop's room. So Leon just loves hats? <laughs> yeah, this is Leon's room. He has... Oh my god. So many hats. <laughs> Uh, gym equipment, of course. Gotta stay in shape for that pose. Uh, oh, okay, won't let me interact with that. Looks like the piles of magazines there. I'm sure he has lots of sponsorships and things. Fields with books that seem hard to understand. Really? Because they honestly look like graphic novels. <laughs> oh, what did I say? Uh, only adults read those types of books. Oh, okay, I'm going to walk away from those. <laughs> Considering what I just said. <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs> oh boy. Leon's a weeb. <laughs> Alright. Sorry, Hop, I was snooping. <laughs> I remember Hyro, or Hero. I used to say Hyro, to be honest. Uh, well, Pokemon could come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. Wait, hang on. I thought you could see them in the wild now. Is it a combination of both? <laughs> it's got a wounding. Oh, boy, oh, yeah. So, yeah, I, na I named him Hero, but I used to say Hyro by mistake all the time. Also sounds cool. Um, yeah, so y I'm sure you're very ready for battles with wild Pokemon with your fluffy sheep. Does it just no tackle, too? But not you, Hero. So we'll steer clear of the tall grass as we go, because you're a loser who doesn't have a Pokemon, even though they're everywhere. <laughs> I kind of, like, kick that bud you once and then throw in a Pokeball at it. But no, I'm not allowed to have a Pokeball. <laughs> Cut the music. Hey, Hop. Lol. No! <laughs> this is gonna stop me. Okay. <laughs> Fine. Let's keep going then. Oh, thanks. Nope. Oh, well, something's happening down here. Oh, of course, it's his brother, so everyone's gonna be, um, oops. Mate, he says. Oh, dear. <laughs> yeah, so it's Leon's famous, so of course they're all gonna be, um, gathered down here to see him. Who let slip he was gonna be here? Oh really? He's in his like full outfit as well. Oh it is a cap! Oh for God's sake, he loves the attention. <laughs> the little kids. <laughs> the Charizard isn't even posing, he's just like, yeah. <laughs> he does this everywhere. <laughs> Your champion Leon is back. <laughs> Oh, don't bring the battles here. God, <laughs> you've got a Charizard. This place is like 80% grass. <laughs> You're gonna burn the whole place to the ground. 
<laughs> oh, he's being inspirational. <laughs> oh my god, these bloody... These character models are so nice looking. The frame rate's not perfect, but it, I mean, it's good enough. <laughs> it's like, anyone want to fight me? It's like, yeah, you're like level 80, we're good. <laughs> Shouldn't that be fulfill of the gym challenge? Hmm. Very hammy. Wait, that was Jarzard's noise? <laughs> Aww. Aww. <laughs> I was wondering what kind of relationship they would have. I was hoping it wasn't going to be like, yeah, I'm busy right now, come back later. <laughs> He's my number one fan. <laughs> <laughs> Are you keeping track on exactly how much he grows? Good grief. Bingo! That's a sort of sharp eye that's kept you undefeated so long, y Ellie. Yeah, of course. Just, you know, being able to tell how much people have grown. I guess him calling him Lee is partially a pet name and also partially supposed to be a very, very short secret so that we don't know it's Leon immediately. <laughs> Those bright eyes over here. I got it. You must be Hero, am I right? No. <laughs> I've heard loads about you from my little brother. Well, you would want to be a Charizard fan, considering. The unbeatable Leon. Well, we'll be um, ruining that later. <laughs> okay, so you you two are going to tell me I bet I can beat you back home while you paralyze me in place. Always wanted to be the best, isn't he? With a proper rival of his own, I bet he'd push himself to become something truly special. Oh my god, all the sponsors on this cape! <laughs> He's such a sellout! <laughs> Well, everyone, I bid you farewell to for today, but don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Galar can have a champion time. I wonder if he drops this persona when he's home and goes, Ugh. <laughs> Just takes a nap. Or if he's like that even at the table. And his own mother's like, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, cutscene. Oh, he's going to give them to us. That's fun. Oh, wow! That was quick as well. There wasn't much um, build-up. There was no, like, accidental encounter without them or anything. We didn't end up in the forest. <laughs> hey, Grookey. Scorbunny. And... Soul. <laughs> Alright, I already decided I'm not gonna nickname anything. At least for the first run-through. Oh, that's cute. Um, because... I have this problem where if I nickname things too early, I will not pick up on the names of their evolutions as they evolve later properly. Like, I'll see them at once and then completely forget them. And then later on, then... Oh. Good grief. Basically, it's so I can remember their names later. Aw, you made him cry, you dick. <laughs> They've been out for like five seconds and they're already causing trouble. Wow. Good god, Scarbunny. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Still have the soulless trainer expression. <laughs> Alright. Yep, I'm obviously taking this level. I already knew what I was going for. I actually... I like all of them this time. I wasn't sure if I was going to, but after, I did see their final evolutions and that does matter um, to my decision. Because I don't mind too much what their um, first and second evolutions are like. Because all their first evos are fine here. Second evolutions kind of hit or miss, depending. Um, third is where it's at, though, because that's where you end up spending the most time. Um, and all their third evolutions, I'm good with, actually. So, yeah, I'm going for Sobble. It adapts to anything as surely as water flows. It's so adaptable, it's depressing. <laughs> Because it suffers from crippling depression. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Alright, Sobble, don't cry. <laughs> um, I'm not nicknaming you at this time. I'm sure I can nickname you later if I need to. Alright. <laughs> yep, so he's obviously gonna take... Oh, no, he's taking the one that's weak against. Okay, so... Um, 
I'm pretty sure there is another rival. I don't know if they use the last one or not though, so Grookey might go unused. It depends on what the game's like. Alright. Uh, set the wool on fire. <laughs> Go ahead, try to reach me. You won't. <laughs> Aw, poor Grookey, no one picked him! <laughs> oh, okay, good. <laughs> it's like, and you, you've disappointed me for the last time. <laughs> no. <laughs> You'll keep him, so that's fine. Oh, no! Oh no, Charizard will show you the ropes. We've left the one that's weakest to Charizard behind. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> well, it's dead. <laughs> Alright, dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. Oh, the barbecue's getting used already. What is he doing? Yeah, cook! <laughs> <laughs> I want to have at least one fight before I take my first pause, because I'm going to record this in um, chunks. The next day... Oh wow, okay. You spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right up? Uh, we're going to have to arrest you. <laughs> you two getting on alright? Understanding one another? Uh, he set my sheets on fire. <laughs> I woke up and went, oh no, I've wet the bed! Oh, it's just Sobble. Oh no, Sobble's wet the bed! <laughs> Maybe even built up a bit of love? Of course I have. Yeah. Of course we have. They're adorable. It's like kittens. Where they're somehow cunningly designed to trick us into really liking them. Even though they're monstrous sociopaths. <laughs> Wow, he really doesn't drop the the, 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 um, the persona, does he? Oh boy. Yep, so we're rivals straight away, and the point of our ri rival hood is Leon. Oh right, so he's gonna immediately challenge me, is he? Oh, so we're gonna use his arena. His, his tiny little ring. <laughs> yeah, of course, let's go for it. I have elemental advantage, so this will be short. <laughs> Champion time. Here we go. First match. Alright, let's do it. Every magazine? <laughs> I love the idea of Leon going, wait, hang on, which magazines? <laughs> I know exactly what to do in order to win. Cheat! <laughs> oh wait, he's got both. So I've got elemental advantage, but I do have to beat two. Assuming he uses it. Oh, I love this animation. Yeah, he's got both! First battle and it's against two, wow. Alright, here we go. Oh wait, I have to beat the Wulu first? How weak is it then? Yeah, that's kind of an unfair advantage! Okay, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Pound and Growl. We're not good. I think we might actually be screwed. Um, is it worth growling? I don't think it is. I think I just have to go for Pounds and see if I can knock it out. It might be a two at KO if I'm lucky. Oh, it's not! Okay, it's alright, he's weak as anything. Um, in fact, you know what? For the sake of it, I'm gonna go for a growl. Uh, it looks like it's gonna take another couple of pans. Oh wow, I just realised, you can see Leon standing in the background even. God, these battle, this battle background is gorgeous. I hope they port a bunch of these to um, multiplayer battles and things like that and don't just have one static background. Oh, whoa, that looked like a high roll. Or am I just not paying enough attention? <laughs> right, so it looks like it is a 3 k thankfully. But um, now I'm gonna be at like half health for a second guy, and I don't have an element of advantage. Wait, will I gain a level? Yes, and then gain bubble? Water gun, okay. I understand now, right, okay. So it is stacked in my favor. That's actually, that's very clever to throw us in with, um, against two, and use that advantage to, sh uh, sorry, that, uh, opportunity to show us the leveling up mechanic. That's very cool. Well, this is gonna be a one or a two shot, so... Ooh, woof. <laughs> yeah, no, I definitely didn't know. 
Oh, I'm so sorry, but you're dead. That's funny that that can happen, though. I guess um, if you don't use it, he doesn't say that. That's cool. I wonder if that means there's a few points throughout the game where um, if you make the right move, you'll get an optional dialogue. That's neat. I didn't hear anything about that. Oh, wow, those stats are pretty good. I wasn't sure because um, a couple of the previous gens, the um, starters have had sort of speed issues in particular. That's pretty quick. For level 7 at least. High speed, high special attack. That's what I wanted. Very good. Yep. Well, it's more like you sent out your weaker one first and let me get a level advantage on you, so... Well, I suppose it wouldn't have been much better the other way if I knocked out the first one, but I think we would have been more evenly matched. Oh yeah, please don't do that! Please <laughs> trap us! <laughs> Let me join in! No! <laughs> he does have more than just the Charizard, right? Okay, oh well, he's got a favor to ask. Be a real rival. I mean, I've beaten him already. <laughs> Alright, so we're jumping straight to the gym challenge. That's cool. Sometimes the gym challenge is kind of a backdrop in games, so I like it being in the forefront. The cart before the Rapidash. <laughs> Best think about getting a Pokedex. Oh, okay, so they are tying the two together, so it's rather than two sort of disconnected things. Nice. Alright. I'm going to have to pause in a moment because my video is going to end. Yep, okay, I'm going to stop now and save. Alright, and that will be my first first part. Oh, that's cool, I really love that. I really love the graphical changes, they're very, like... I know there's an issue with Nintendo where they don't really make very big jumps in graphics, and they're like 10 years behind or something ridiculous. More, to be honest. But, um... I really- oh. No, I did not hear that just now. I'm gonna stop. <laughs> That's enough for the moment. Alright, um, I'm gonna take a break and I'll be-